This is probably a little bit of a jump scare for you, but I decided last minute to film a week in my life. It is currently Monday. I woke up, put my contacts in, realized my under eye bags were so bad. I made the bed, put the table up. Now I need to film a TikTok for this brand and I need to edit it and send it to them by today. So we got to get that done. And this is another reason why I have these eye masks on because I don't want my puffy eyes. You know. Anyways, um, I'm on the floor because the best lighting is right here and I have my phone set up and ready to go. I just need to take these off and I need to do something else with my hair. I just finished filming for Deepology so hopefully I can edit that and get that set over to them and they can improve it so I can post it. Now I need to hurry up, get some light makeup on, and go. And I decided to film a regular TikTok on top of the brand TikTok. Why do I do this myself? Because I film my entire life. Makeup is done and my outfit is on. I just have a Colorado Rocky shirt on and these purple leggings. And then I'm also gonna put a jacket on because it is cloudy today, a little bit chilly. And honestly, I am opening up one of these right now. I just need to pick that up off the floor since I needed my laptop out because I kind of wrote out a little bit of a script for the branded content. Plus they sent me over things that they don't want me to say. So I wanted to make sure I didn't say any of those because I just want this first draft to be one and done. I don't want them to be like, oh, you gotta redo it. I'm back from my seasonal job and it is still cloudy out. It sprinkled for 0.2 seconds and then it was done. But I also wanted to update you on my jewelry business. I ended up redoing these rings and they look so much better. I also made this pendant. It turned out so good. It's so cute and I love it. So I am getting better. Now that I have better materials, it makes things so much easier. It still takes time, but things aren't overburning anymore. So we're getting the hang of things. Right now, since I didn't have time to edit and send off my brand video, I'm going to do that now. I'm also going to add a watermark to it because that's just what I do with brands. When there's a rough draft, I always send it with a watermark and I wait for my payment to come through before I post it and give them access to the video just because I have been ripped off from a brand before. They didn't pay me. I got, I ended up getting paid, but I said that I was going to say something on social media and it would look bad for their brand. I ended up getting paid just two months later. So that is my new thing. It's a whole learning process, especially since I'm my own manager. I honestly should figure out manager situation. Probably help me out a lot. Okay, I sent the draft. Hopefully it gets approved and I don't have to refilm anything. We'll be good to go. Oh, also at work I did have some pizza and my coworker I bought a soda for in my last video bought me a soda this time. So now I got two cups and the sun is going down. Honestly, I'm not starving, but I'm gonna make a Caesar salad and a quesadilla. I already made dinner and I already started eating dinner. Cheese quesadilla, Caesar salad in a bag. I love how the trail mix bag is right there. I love cheese quesadillas. I don't care what anyone says, always hit. I love them. So good. I have just been sitting here on my laptop doing emails and I've also been scrolling for a little bit. I haven't really scrolled for a long time in a while and I'm not gonna lie, I kind of did that. I need to take off my makeup, brush my teeth, take out my contacts, take down the table, lay out the bed, and then do everything again tomorrow. I feel like I need to be a little bit more productive tomorrow than I was today. Okay, that's a lie. I did a lot. I am so exhausted. I feel like I'm always exhausted. Even if I get a good amount of sleep, I'm still tired. <laughs> do all the other things that I just listed, and I'll see you tomorrow. It's the next morning and I am freezing because I didn't have time to go to Planet Fitness this morning, so I'm gonna go this evening. I needed to wash my body off, so I did it with a washcloth. I do have a water heater. It just takes a second to kick in and I'm like, whatever, it'll help wake me up. But now I'm cold. It's crazy because last week it was hot and now the temperature dropped. But I don't wanna complain too much because I don't want it to get too hot before the season is over. I also did not put my dishes away from yesterday. It's 
gonna be a little dark. I'm opening up a yogurt. I always eat a little bit out and then I put the granola in. Actually, let me be honest. Sometimes I'm lazy to even eat a little bit first and then the granola is just everywhere. That's the truth. But this way, if you eat like a few bites out, you can get more granola. You can just mix it up and you can add more if you please. I think this will be good. Ooh, I'm not rushing rushing this morning, but I probably should move just a little faster. Last night before I brushed my teeth, I did open up the trail mix and I did have some. I wish I had some Ziploc baggies in here so I could bring some into work today. I can't bring that whole bag. I don't want to be carrying it around. I'll be back when I'm ready to go for the day. Up is done. Outfit is on. It's a D-backs long sleeve black leggings, my everyday new balances. Many hours later, my seasonal job went good. I did film this clip. Another beautiful day. And then I also ended up getting island noodles and I was a little disappointed. I love island noodles, but there wasn't many noodles and there was a lot of veggies. Slightly disappointed in that, but. And then I got done and then I came to this park and I've been working on my laptop, on my phone. The deep Apology video got approved so that will be getting posted March 1st. But yeah, I have just been rotting and sitting in this spot. I wanted to go to Planet Fitness tonight to work out and then shower and like wash my hair. But I'm gonna just do it in the morning. I don't know if I'll work out in the morning, but I'm definitely gonna shower. You have been following along. I did a road trip with my grandparents. We went to this place called Pops in Oklahoma. Just a bunch of soda. Actually still have three of the sodas. Ended up grabbing one and putting it in the fridge. It's called Dog Drool, and it says totally gross soda. It's so disgusting. But it's orange lemon, so I thought, why don't we try it? I wonder if it's actually gonna be like gross or not. It tastes like a watered down popsicle. It's not bad, it's not, would I get it again? No. But is it fun? Yes. I'm going to make dinner, but I think I'm gonna film a TikTok doing it. Got the bacon nice and crispy. Potatoes are going. I just washed two eggs. I was gonna do three, but I'm just gonna do two. I need to get that all crispy, just like how this is so crispy. I'm actually gonna eat one of the bacon slices while I wait for the potatoes. I don't know how people don't love bacon. So good. The cheese is starting to melt, but this burrito is stacked. I also put some orange juice in a cup, and honestly, it's good that I have these cups now because I only have my water bottle and mug. I don't have any cups because I just get like canned soda, if anything. But yeah, so I have orange juice in here. And of course, Vasco sauce. And you're probably like, Haley, you made this last week. Yes, I did. I have such a small fridge, so I just need to use up what I have, especially the freezer. And the potatoes were taking up the freezer. Kind of put a lot of Tabasco sauce, but I love it. How many times do you think I have said, I'm gonna go to bed early tonight? A lot. My camera battery is flickering. I'm gonna eat the rest of this, and then I need to clean up. And then I just need to wind down for the night. I have not picked up the camera in a very long time. I ended up going to bed 30 minutes earlier than I normally do. And that's because I was gonna wake up an hour earlier so I could go to the gym, do a run, and wash my hair. That did not happen. I ended up waking up an hour late. So I had a rush this morning. This was my outfit, just all black with black leggings. And then a Rockies hat. I'm at Planet Fitness now. I'm gonna run. I'm gonna walk and I'm gonna shower. If I don't do it right now, it's just not gonna happen. <laughs> we're here and we're gonna go in. I'm not even gonna lie, I'm kind of starving right now. I'm gonna try to do this, be out in an hour. Hopefully that's the case. And I'm, I don't, I don't think I'm cooking anything tonight. I think I'm gonna get stuff to go. But I have to pack my whole little bag. This is my little shower bag. Towel needs to go into the shower bag. Hairbrush needs to go. Towel is in. Hairbrush. I'm also gonna take makeup remover. And there's the hairbrush. And then hairbrush. It's a good thing that I didn't go in yet because I need the shower shoes and I also need a new outfit to put on. I'm back and I'm fresh and clean. I ended up running a mile and walking a mile 
and then I hit the shower. Obviously, took a shower, starving. So I'm gonna figure out what I want to pick up. I might have gone a little crazy for dinner because I also got myself a dessert. I got Cafe Rio, and this is a shredded pork enchilada style burrito. And then, this is where I went really crazy. See, the thing is, this place is called Dirty Dough, and it's basically like crumble cookie. I personally never was obsessed with crumble cookie. I had it a few times, probably like three or four times, but I am craving chocolate and could have just gotten one, but I decided to get four. And after we eat and later this evening, we are going to do a taste test of each one and try them out. But right now, I'm gonna dig into this. I also got a strawberry lemonade. I didn't get a soda, but lemonade still has caffeine, but still, strawberry lemonade. I'm going to watch Walking Dead and just eat and chill out. It's time to dive in on these cookies. They look so good. I'm also going to explain what each one is. So the first one I'm doing is raspberry fudge brownie. Rich fudge brownie cookie dough mixed with white chocolate chips stuffed with raspberry filling and hot fudge topped with white icing drizzle. Let's give it a go. Okay, I'm not really big on like raspberry, strawberry type filling of things. This isn't too bad. Definitely really sweet. I also picked what I think my least favorite is going to be, which is this one. Next one we're going to try is the cookies and cream. Vanilla cookie loaded with Oreo cookie chunks and white chocolate chips stuffed with cream filling and topped with white icing and Oreo crumble. This looks amazing. Mmm! This one's my favorite so far. I love, I love, I love. Now we're gonna try the Brookie. It's a brown cookie with caramel surprise. Perfect combination of a brownie, a chocolate chip cookie filled and drizzled in caramel sauce. That sounds amazing. This looks so good too. I feel like it's a little underdone in the middle. Don't love, but don't hate. The last one's the Muscle, and I'm pretty sure this is the most popular one. Signature dirty taste with a clean 25 grams of protein. A fudge brownie protein cookie loaded with real Reese's peanut butter chips stuffed with peanut butter protein and topped with fudge and peanut butter protein drizzle. I'm excited about this one because I love peanut butter. That is really good, but I'm not gonna lie. I think the cookies and cream comes in first, then the muscle, then the brookie, and then this raspberry one. I actually really don't like that one. And the filling is just not my type of thing. Um, I'm gonna have cookies for the rest of the week. I'm so full and I feel like I didn't even make a dent into them. It's the next day. We need to start getting ready. I also think I'm gonna put a little eye mask underneath my eyes while I just make my bed and get my outfit out for the day. I should not be this tired, but I am. And I already opened up my curtains for the day. And then I sat back down. These feel so nice. I also just slept in what I wore when I got out of the shower at the gym. I was too lazy to change into my, like, weekly pajamas, so I just stayed in this. I have about an hour to get ready. That's great. I say that, and the next thing you know, I'm rushing. <sighs> this is what happens. I end up sitting here when I need to get a move on. I need to get a move on. And that is so bad, because I already sat this morning to think about my whole entire life, and I don't need to be doing it again. All right, let's go. Also, this is the reality. I have not put these away. I have not put these away. We're gonna do that right now. It took me one minute. Why did it take me so long to do it? Great question. I don't have the answer to that. I put the table up, made the bed. I'm taking these off, and I need to start doing my makeup. But the question is, do I also wanna film a TikTok while I do my makeup? I ended up filming a TikTok get ready with me and I actually want to talk to you guys what I just filmed my TikTok about because it's about my jewelry business. If you're new here, I'm starting a jewelry business. It's called Faithful Nomadic Finds. It's sea glass that I have found and then I am soldering it into jewelry, mostly rings and pendants. That's just what I'm starting with. And my plan was after my seasonal job, I would get back in the van, start working on it right away and that's what I was doing. But now that that spring training and games have actually physically started but it makes it so difficult when now I'm going in seven days a week 
for a little bit longer than I was pre-season. It just, I don't have enough time to take everything out, put everything away, also feed myself and put everything away. And I feel like I've been slacking on my end when it comes to jewelry, but I will say I did redo these pieces, like I said at the beginning of this video. So I feel like I've been slacking, but a few days ago, a lady pointed out my rings. She asked where I got them and I said I made them and she was like, no way. And then I told her about how I'm starting a jewelry business and sea glass that I have found and it made me realize okay maybe I'm not slacking I'm just not documenting it enough my main focus on my jewelry business instead of doing it every single day I focus on it Friday Saturday and Sunday and my main focus through the week is YouTube Monday through Friday along with filming my normal TikToks and whatnot because I'm like doing the most I know I am doing a lot but <laughs> Anyway, so my main focus for my jewelry business Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and I just haven't really been filming. And I know I said on YouTube I wouldn't really show much. I did create a whole TikTok jewelry account, and I've been really slacking on creating content. But for me, I've learned, since I'm learning a whole new skill, me setting up the camera and focusing on angles and clips to get, I was starting to focus more on the content end rather than me learning a whole new skill. That's kind of my update on the jewelry business. My makeup is done. I need to get changed and then we need to head over to my seasonal job and then I'll see you when I am done I finished up at my seasonal job and then I went to the grocery store and now I'm at this park and I'm gonna start editing for YouTube but this is what I got for my dinner tonight these bad boys I've been hyper fixated on these that's why I keep getting them but it's just this spinach and ricotta ravioli. Every time I go to the grocery store, they're out of this Italian sausage and they weren't this time, but it also has with mozzarella cheese. So I'm gonna have some of that. And then this is the best ranch ever, lighthouse and carrots. So I'm actually gonna snack on this right now. I'm just gonna go like that. That way I don't have to do any dishes. I just finished dinner. The ravioli, the sausage, and then I put some pasta sauce on. I'm gonna eat and then get back to working. I did a TikTok live for 30 minutes and now I'm editing this video and I'm also having some of the cookies right now. I officially decided after the other three, the raspberry fudge just is not my thing. And I love raspberries and I love chocolate, but I don't like that type of filling. Like I don't like that texture. It doesn't feel like real raspberries. It feels fake and yeah, I don't know. It's Friday morning. I put some eye patches on. I just put up the table in the bed and I picked out my outfit for the day. I'm about to take these off because they've been on. I'm gonna get going on my makeup and get dressed and hopefully I have some time to edit a little bit. I need to post the Depology video and then send over the code to them. So let's get going. My necklaces are all crooked. I need to fix this. I'll fix it in a little bit. Anyways, or did I fix it? I think we're good now. This is my outfit. I just have a sweatshirt on right now. I have black leggings and then of course my black running shoes. I can't believe it's already Friday. Today has already been a day and it's not even close to being over. After my seasonal job, I started driving to my grandparents' house and on the way I filled up on propane and then I also obviously dumped my tank at my grandparents and I'm staying at my parents' house tonight. But I'm gonna be focusing on making jewelry and like I explained yesterday, I just need to focus on that and not worry about content necessarily right now. I'm excited though for tomorrow because my parents' neighborhood is doing like a little community music festival thing. It's another reason why I will be driving to my seasonal job and then driving back. And it's the weekend so traffic isn't as bad but it's still, it's still gonna be a little over an hour of a drive. With traffic it's almost like two hours. But yeah, this evening jewelry and even later in the night I'm going to continue editing this. I'm also not looking forward to waking up extra early. All right I need to get a move on. Actually before we get a move on I'm taking a bite of the cookies and cream. Are you a type of person that saves best for last or do you eat best first? I always thought it was weird when people eat the best first because don't you want to end on the best? I don't know. 
It has the frosting, it has the Oreos. The rest is for later. Now we get to work. It's officially Saturday and I'm back from my seasonal job. This morning I ended up just driving my SUV to work. It took me an hour and eight-ish minutes and then on my way back an hour and 12-ish minutes. So, and that's the weekend. So, on my way to work, I ended up getting Dunkin' because I have a gift card. I got a mango pineapple refresher. I also tried their sourdough breakfast sandwich, and it was so good. I've never had it before. Then I was at work, and next thing you know, the HR brings in a ham and Swiss croissant from Starbucks, and they never have them in stock. Ever. And that's twice this week that I got one of those because my other coworker brought me one a few days ago. I had a big breakfast this morning, but I was actually really hungry. Usually I'm not overly hungry in the morning. It was a beautiful day for baseball. Now I'm back and I'm going to start doing some of my jewelry business. And then this evening I'm going with my sister and parents to this little community music festival. Let me give you a little recap on my night. My sister and parents and I walked down to the street that was hosting the little music festival. And my grandparents ended up being there. They drove the few streets because they can't walk that distance, but they were there. Music was already playing. There was two food trucks, one with ice cream and soda, and then the other one was tacos, burritos. My grandma made a good call. We stood in line before it was even open, and it was packed. I ended up getting a California burrito. It had rice, carne asada, cheese, onions, cilantro, oh, and french fries in it as well. So it was really good. It was huge. I did not finish it, so I took the other half with me. There's a lot more people that attended this year than last year. I was there for an hour and a half two-ish hours it's just a cute little fun community thing and but i'm gonna end this week's video here i hope you enjoyed i am just constantly working i'm just working literally all the time and i know i said this a lot but i can't wait to get back to traveling i just like creating that type of content like exploring and i mean i like picking up the camera and filming lifestyle anyways but like i just love the travel aspect because it's just so fun to explore next week i I don't have an idea of what I'm gonna do. Maybe a day in life, maybe what I eat in a day, I don't know. I guess we'll see. <laughs>